Uh, Vicki, it all started around 6 o'clock this morning. A leak somewhere in the system leading to a pump failure at the Brandenburg water plant. And the pump is already repaired, but the location of the leak is still unknown. And until it's found, there's no timetable for getting the water back on. Not having water is worse than not having electricity. 1,500 customers left dry due to a leak in the city of Brandenburg's water supply. A local company bringing a tanker filled with 1,700 gallons of water to City Hall so residents can fill up. We just so happen to have our grandson staying with us this weekend or this week, and uh, he's going to football camp, and you know, no shower. We've got, we've got to do something. We've got to make a plan for him to get a shower. <laughs> Meantime, the mayor and other city officials addressing the crisis as residents begin running out of water. And they've had varying degrees of no water to very little water. Uh, we have not managed to get ahead of this leak. Uh, we're working diligently to do that. I know there is still people that's out of water, but there is a few that still have it that I would guess that before this is over, they'll lose it as well. City officials here in Brandenburg say so far their efforts to find the leak have been unsuccessful, but wherever it is, it's a big one. Those same officials say 400 gallons a minute are disappearing from the Brandenburg water system and they don't know where the water's going. You know, if this is going into an underground cavern, we may not be able to find it for a long period of time because it's just not going to surface. City and county officials have reached out to Fort Knox in hopes the military base can supply trucks of water. Meantime, a semi-truck loaded with bottled water from the state of Kentucky is expected to arrive in the morning. Without water, many businesses in Brandenburg have been forced to close. Car washes are shut down, as are many fast food restaurants and pizza places. Well, it's put a little down for a lot of our calls have been, is your buffet down, is your buffet open? But we do have carry out. Been okay, but it, it could be better. As the search for the source of the water leak in Brandenburg continues, consultant and former mayor David Pace has this advice for those without water. Patience is the number one key just to be there. They're working on it around the clock, so just give them a little time. And we do have an update for you now. Late word tonight, the water leak in Brandenburg has been located. I just spoke with the public works director. He says it's too early to tell when water might be flowing again, but there is a meeting scheduled with the mayor and city officials for 8 o'clock tomorrow morning. More information is expected to be released at that time. But again, it looks like the water emergency in Brandenburg may be close to being over. Reporting live in the studio tonight, Randall Cam, WLKY News.